guys, uh, welcome to Mac Tip number two. This is how I edit, record, and export in iMovie 08 when I'm making my videos for YouTube or if I'm just making a video. So, firstly, you want to go over and hit File, New Project, 16.9 if you like it in a widescreen for YouTube, uh, name it as what you want. I'm just going to put Mac Tip. Create. Uh, so I then go if it's not from a device like a digital camcorder, a uh, video camera, I just click open camera import, which is this little box down there. And then I choose built in eyesight. Turn that lamp up. Sorry about this. So I just uh, choose that, choose uh, 1024 by 576, capture, and uh, I just capture a bit of video for a few seconds, uh, you stop it, and it just processes it. And then that's there, the video that I just took and processed. So before that, I'd want to put my intro though in. So I'd go find my intro. I'm sorry about that. Uh, I find my intro. And Mac tip intro. And I'll just import that. It shouldn't take long, guys, when you're importing stuff, depending on the size and the quality. So that's there. So I want to select the entire intro first. Then I simply just drag it to the top left, to the first box, and I'll just get rid of that one down there to take my mind off it. And for the intro I want to add some music. So I'll just go over to music, make sure it's your own music guys or just a jingle in here. And then you will not get done by the copyright infringement on YouTube. So I do catwalk short, drag it over to the top left, far left on the intro, let go, and do a tester. So that's fine guys, that's how I want it. Next you'd want to add a transition. The best transition on iMovie VO8 I think is fade through white. So I just drag, or fade through black, both of them two work very well. So I just drag that there, you can see it's popped up. And now I want to select the other video, so I select the entire clip, drag it to the right of that transition, let go, and play it just to make sure that's fine. And uh, I just capture a bit of video for a few seconds, so that's there. And I'll just get rid of that and that. And I'll play the whole thing for you guys, and then I'll show you how I export into HD. And uh, I just capture a bit of video for a few seconds. Uh, you stop. <clears throat> so now I know the video is how I want it, guys. Uh, no major editing. Editing. I'll be doing other Mac tips on different uh, voiceovers, cropping, sound effects, color. Once I've got this one out of the way. So to export, I click share. Export using QuickTime. And you write the name what you want to save it as, where you'd like to save it. It's got to be, and then the options. These are my options, these are preset by me. You just preset yours and they'll stay the same until you change them. So, the file format is MP4. Video, you have to click on now. And the video format's got to be H.264. The data rate has got to be 5,000 kilobytes per second, optimized for download. Image size 1280 by 720 HD. Frame rate current 24 frames, keyframe every. So that's the video sorted out. Then you click audio. And this is so it will not lag on YouTube, guys. 
So what it is is AAC dash LC for music, and then you want the data rate at 128 kilobytes per second, channels stereo, output sample rate recommended, encoding quality better, and then that's OK. So they're done, and then you click save. Obviously, I'm not going to export it now, guys. Well, all you'd have to do is export it like that, and you're done. So, and it will be in HD once you upload it to YouTube and widescreen. So, that was my Mac tip number two, showing you how I record, edit, and export in iMovie 08. Any suggestions, guys, let me know in the comments below or send me a personal message. Thanks a lot for that. See you soon.